We were just a few days after Mumbai was flooded. Bengaluru comes to a standstill as heavy rain lashed the city. Heavy downpour led to flooding of several parts of the city with water gushing into houses in low-lying areas of Koramangla, HSR layout and many other places. The city has drowned with the rainfall of just 6 cm. Though located around 100 meters above the sea level, the city is still struggling to drain off excess water. Well, most of the low-lying areas in Bangalore, especially the posh Koromangla, uh, Maratha Halli, HSR layout, which is very connected to a lot of the inter uh, techies work in this area, uh, reside in these areas, in are inundated with water. Okay, let me show you, I am in Koromangla 4th block, uh, just a small spell of rain yesterday's night. This is the situation what you are seeing here, clearly water has entered entire the area, premises here. Water somewhat has receded, but there's a huge sludge in this area, which is still uh, affecting the problem. What the local residents are saying, questioning is, is this is a situation happening for almost seven to eight years. And yes, last year, the government went on a massive pro, uh, uh, project to say that they will clear out the water, they'll clear stormwater drains so that locals don't have to face this situation. But what we're seeing here clearly is you can see the sludge is there. Water has receded, but you can see water still in the houses. There needs to be drained out this water but uh, locals are still facing the problem let me go across to the local resident and get to him sir last uh, last year the government promised a lot said a lot of steps have been initiated why is the situation remain the same have you contacted the local uh, councillor been contacting the councillor the mla and the regular meetings have been happening and i don't know the so called engineers from the corporation what are they for i really don't know they come and see and have their own solutions but we are facing this problem from 8 years and we are having sleepless nights from the past 10 to 15 days we have small babies around here and some communicable diseases they get into some problems and i don't know whom to who will be held responsible for this it's a pathetic situation out here please can someone help us here that is my only request here let me show you a close what are the kind of problems they are facing not only just the water is entering these areas many of their equipments electronic equipments and the usable daily usable goods are also perished here you can see here residents have thrown out what their good TVs fridge refrigerators all these things because of the water which entered their areas and they no longer are usable now not only th even though the water receded but they have to face this sludge and this is an everyday problem because many of the residents here who store water the sludge has entered the drinking water and they have to buy the water every day from outside and they have to call somebody to clean the drain the water out even though the bbmp workers are here they are clearing the sludge but short spell of rain the situation remains to where it was before